guys, welcome to the Burn Youth Online Holiday Special. Uh, we're actually all watching this together on Zoom right now. So if you're watching from YouTube, there will be a link posted in the chat right next to me. Um, and that will take you to the Zoom chat. I'm Annika. And I'm Jackson. And today what we're doing is Noob vs Pro Bake Off. Annika, you're obviously the pro, so what are we doing today? We are going to be making Swedish style cinnamon buns, which I think are the best style cinnamon buns, but I'm the best. I've just got myself a pot because we're going to be heating up the milk. But if you're vegan, you can use coconut milk. Alright, I'm going to put a little bit of sugar because yeast is just like a little human, you know. You've got to nurture it, you've got to give it uh, food, so the sugar is its food. I'm putting five grams of that in there. That's seven. Um, we're putting, and we're putting a bit of yeast in there uh, because that is what we need to, what we need to bloom, you know. Now I have a big old bag of this, but if you're using sachets, seven grams is actually all you need. We've got our flour. Wait, I've got another packet of flour. Flour, we need 400 grams of that. We need to put a little bit more sugar in here. This is sugar number two. So we're gonna put 45 grams. Okay, it's nice and warm. You can dip your finger in there to feel it. You wanna feel it? No. No? I don't know if my hands are. Oh. Have I? Yes. <laughs> I washed my hands. <laughs> Alright, now you put the yeast in there, you just sprinkle it on top and it will spread out. Look at that, that's cool. And I'm gonna rest that to the side. I'm actually going to put a tea towel on top of it because the yeast needs darkness. Okay, I'm just gonna whisk this up a little bit, but apart from that, we just need to wait about five minutes for the yeast to rest and bloom. It will it will turn all foamy and fluffy. So it's all fluffy now, have a look at that. Pretty cute. It's foamy, that's, that's the word. All right, uh, actually we could have been melting butter that whole time. For five minutes. Yeah, I didn't realize. Um, so, I'm going to put some butter in there because what we're going to do is put the yeast and the milk in there and the flour and the butter and all dough needs like a fat content and that's what our butter will be and then it needs the yeast and the flour and everything. So I need to put 56 grams of butter. Now just to annoy Jackson. Um, it is essential that you touch the butter. You need to use your hands. Yeah. It makes it more accurate in the process. 47. 54. The nice thin slice. 56. Is that how much you need? To a floured, yeah. floured surface. Work it all together and then eventually you're going to reach a, um, a certain elasticity of the dough. Right now it's too like not elastic, you know. It, we do this thing called the window test where you pull it and if it tears it's not quite ready. So you keep doing it and then a little bit later you can get another little chunk of dough and pull it and see if it creates a little see-through window without tearing and then it's ready. So I'm going to slap that in there and then we're going to give it a little bit more darkness and warmth again. Uh, my oven actually has like a dough rising setting which is perfect. So I'm just going to rise this dough for a little bit. In here. And so this is actually, it's like a little bit bigger than it was before. Is it? Yeah, it's fine. Wow. 
She'll be right. Why Do you think it, it is? Expand? Yeah, okay. It expands because it releases gas. What kind of gas? <laughs> Carbon dioxide. Really? Wow. Yeah. I just have a big old bank of knowledge up in my head here. And I'm just going to roll this out into a square. The trick is make the dough a circle-ish. Maybe I kind of push the corners out a little bit. But then if you do it this way and this way, and then this way and this way, it actually starts turning into a rectangle. You said square. Like that. I'm in a rectangle, not a square. Um, <laughs> be quiet. It's a rectangle. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's a square. Wait. It's a rectangle. No, 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 no. Okay. Sorry, sometimes you just get really annoying. You just like. <sighs> yeah, well, I don't like you anymore. <laughs> Can we still be friends? Yeah. Oh, okay. I was, gonna, I was actually going to ask you that anyway. Wow. Hey. Now, you can mm. use your hands if you want. It's like poop. It does not look like... That's so mean of you! <laughs> this is like my... This is like my favourite thing to make. Can you just go and poo on it? No pun intended. <laughs> Surely we're like getting so much footage that we actually have some mildly funny stuff in here. You don't think I'm funny? Do you think I'm funny? How much of the time? Uh, Give me a percentage. If I were a worm, would you think I was funnier? Uh, yeah. Probably love me more, wouldn't you? If I was a worm. More? Yeah, if I was a worm. I wouldn't love you at all. That's it. Hey, <laughs> just don't go. Alright, is it my turn? Mm-hmm. Hi, my name's Jackson. I'm uh, 22 years old. I've got a advanced diploma in screen and media. Uh, I've pretty much never been in a kitchen my whole life, but I, I 3D modeled a, a cinnamon bun once, so basically more than qualified. <laughs> Surprised he was even able to 3D model a cinnamon bun. <laughs> Apparently doesn't know what they look like. <laughs> That was the Noob versus Pro Bake Off. Uh, comment in the chat, who's you thought was better? And also in the chat, there is a link. If you're still on YouTube, it is for Zoom, because we're all on there. It's hubs time now, so click that link, or if you're already in Zoom, we can head out into breakout rooms. Enjoy hubs time. Hey youth, we've got a special announcement for you tonight before we wrap up the service. Now we've been sitting on this one for quite some time and I was super eager to spoil it and kind of leak the info a bit early, but I've waited about a whole term been sitting on this one. We've got a trailer to show you. Check it out. Do you not know? Have you not heard? Has it not been told you from the beginning? Thank you.